Hi, and welcome to sound painting video number 16, where every Saturday you're going to get your weekly fix of sound painting. Uh, for those of you who've been watching uh, up to this point, you'll notice that the backdrop looks a little different. I'm actually doing this video today off of my computer, my Mac um, laptop computer uh, webcam. I had a great time on the tour with Danielson, got back, uh, and either have A, lost somewhere on the road uh, my little flip cam that I usually use to record these videos, or uh, B, someone stole it. So if you happen to be at Johnny Brenda's on Sunday night at the Danielson show and have found a flip camera floating around, please, please contact me. But anyway, the series must go on. So here we are, uh, episode number 16, where uh, I'll continue to delve into sound painting, which, as you know, is a sign language for composing in real time. It's created by Walter Thompson. Check out the link below, soundpainting.com. Um, so today I want to work with a uh, when gesture. We've been focused a lot on some of the what's and the how's, but there's a lot of power in, in the who's and the when's in the syntax of sound painting. So it's usually who, what, sometimes a how, and always a when. So today I want to work uh, just with one gesture called initiate. And that one is a little tough to demonstrate sitting down, so I'm going to actually stand up for it. But both hands go behind my back, and I straighten up a little bit, and you'll see that I have one hand, let's see if I can do this here, one hand, grab the other at the wrist, and then I sort of just straighten up a bit. So that is an, a go gesture, and that's called initiate. And what that means is the performer enters the composition within somewhere approximately 15 to 20 seconds of seeing the gesture. So it's, a, it's an ad lib. The performer comes in when they desire in the next 15 to 20 seconds. And it's really fascinating as a composer to get that surprise and also get a different quality of response from the performer when they really choose uh, the exact timing of their entrance. So again, that's initiate. So, and for today, since uh, I'm working with the limited resources here, I'm just gonna sort of put my hands behind my back, right? They'll be here, put hands behind the back and straighten up. And that's gonna be the go gesture. All right, so I'll work with just a few simple content gestures like pointillism and long tone, and we'll have fun with initiate. You ready?
All right, thanks for following along. You'll notice I also used this erase gesture, which is a forget about it in sound painting. I was trying to do a minimalism, but as you can see, working within the constraints of this uh, camera, I wasn't able to get it in frame. So anyway, thanks again. Please leave your video response below. And for those of you uh, interested in supporting my sound painting group Zaha, please uh, go to our Kickstarter page. We're launching a tour. I'm really super excited about it. It's going to be at the end of May, and you can find a link below this video to our Kickstarter page with a video and more information about how you can support us. All right, thanks. See you next week.